The ceasefire in Gaza did not stop protesters from disrupting Black Friday shopping here on the Mag Mile. CBS 2's Noel Brennan was on the ground as pro-Palestinian groups took over Michigan Avenue, calling for an end to the war. There's a four-day pause in fighting between Israel and Hamas as hostages are released, but the protests and demonstrations continue in Chicago. On Black Friday, shoppers along Michigan Avenue were caught in the middle of a march in support of Palestine. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. On Black Friday, Michigan Avenue fills up with shoppers and protesters supporting Palestine. This is the Magnificent Mile. This is Michigan Avenue. This is one of the most storied business districts in the entire world. And we're here today to say no business as usual. The momentary disruption along the Mag Mile comes during a brief break in the war between Israel and Hamas that hasn't let up since October 7th. We must maintain momentum as this fragile pause takes shape in the next few days. On Friday, Hamas released 24 hostages in exchange for the freedom of 39 Palestinian prisoners. It's part of a deal brokered earlier this week that calls for Hamas to release 50 hostages and Israel to free 150 Palestinians from prison. This temporary ceasefire is because of the people in the streets, the thousands in Chicago, the millions across the United States, the maybe tens of millions across the world. Organizers of the march in Chicago are hopeful a temporary pause in fighting <laughs> leads to something more permanent. Organizers of the march say this is the 11th time in the past 48 days that they've mobilized people in Chicago in support of Palestine, and it won't be the last. Along Michigan Avenue, Noel Brennan, CBS 2 News.